This twercast is brought to you by Jamalto. Welcome to Anvis Twercast for September 11th, 2017, keeping you up to date with the latest news and events in the Anva community. I'm Claire Jeffrey. Anva is pleased to have published a video demonstrating the mobile DL operational proof of concept that was created in collaboration with the DMV of the Netherlands, or the RDW. The video illustrates how mobile DL technology could work and presents situations in which the technology could be used. Representatives from RDW were in attendance at the AIC for the official debut of the video and received a token of appreciation from Anva's chair of the board and host of the conference, Jean Shiomoto. In the wake of Hurricanes Harvey and Irma, Anva has created a fact sheet with information on handling flood-damaged vehicles. As a result of the flooding associated with hurricanes and other severe storms, hundreds of thousands of vehicles sustain severe weather damage in each weather event. Such water damage can make a vehicle's electrical system, including airbag sensors, prone to failure. Following each hurricane, many states see flood-damaged vehicles enter their used vehicle markets for sale, titling, or registration. View the fact sheet at the Media Center on ANVA's website. ODOT's Origo program, ANVA and RUC West, are pleased to be co-sponsoring the 2017 Road Usage Charge Forum next week in Salem, Oregon. The event will convene policy advisors, consultants, vendors, and transportation experts with a shared ambition to help shape the future of transportation funding and road usage charging. Visit the Road Usage Charge Forum 2017 website for more information. If you have questions, please email myorigo at o.state.or.us or call 503-986-7827. AMBA is looking for jurisdiction members to lend their expertise by serving on our standing committees. Serving on a standing committee is an ideal way to influence policy, develop best practices, and network with your peers. AMBA is looking for volunteers to fill the following positions. If you would like to serve on one of these committees, please complete the committee application form available on the AMBA website. For more information or questions, please contact Michelle Drigo or Diane Graham via email at committees at AMBA.org. ANVA is also seeking volunteers for two working groups. The Ignition Interlock Working Group is looking for motor vehicle administration and law enforcement representatives from the ANVA jurisdictions, as well as one representative from the Legal Services Discipline. The Suspended Driver Alternative Re Reinstatement Working Group is also looking for volunteers. If you are interested in serving on either working group and meet the requirements found on the working group application forms, send a completed application and a short biography to Diane Graham at committees at anva.org. Visit the committees and working groups page on the ANVA website and click on the Working Group Opportunities tab for full details. That's all for this edition of ANVA's Tourcast. Thanks for joining us.